Hey y'all, hey, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It is another beautiful day on God's beautiful earth, guys. Another opportunity for us to live our best life. So happy Monday, happy day two of Vlogtober. We are up and at them this morning. Looking forward to a very great and prosperous day and great start to the week. I hope you all have been having a great start to your week as well. I'm ready for my day. I'm gonna go ahead and get Deuce Man ready. His school is very, very close to our home though. So I normally wake him up and give him about you know, 45 minutes to an hour to get his day started, make sure he eats something. So, um, Deuce Man will eat breakfast at his school. So I typically just fix him like a little something, something to get on his stomach until they have breakfast at school. So I'm gonna go ahead and fix him some French toast sticks and a little cup of juice and then wake him up and get I'm his day started. I'm wake Deuce Man up and here's his breakfast. I fixed him some French toast sticks and a cup of apple juice. Good morning, baby. How are you? <laughs> Deuce Man is just now waking up. Are you ready for school? Yeah. <laughs> Say good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Deuce Man's up and ready now. Today is the first day of bully protection. Mommy, well, what is it called? Mommy, why is bully protection? So yes, it is National Bully Prevention Day at Deuce Man's school, so he has to wear orange. Deuce Man, do you know what a bully is? Um. A bully ball. A bully ball? <laughs> so, a bully is someone who's not nice to you, someone who's always being mean to you and saying not so nice things, okay? So today we're gonna stand up against bullies, okay? So when you're at big boy school and you have a friend that's maybe not being nice, you should say, hey friends, be nice to everybody, okay? okay. And you guys all be friends together, right? Yep, so we have to stand up against bullies today. You wanna show them your watch? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so Deuce Man is super obsessed with this watch. <laughs> so I'm gonna let him take it to school today so he can show his friends. <laughs> All right, are you ready? All right, high five. Yeah, I'm stuck in a little bit of traffic this morning. That sucks, but you know, I still feel like I'm good on time. Like I like to leave work in enough time so that way when I get to work, I don't have to get right to work. <laughs> but anyway, so when I was dropping Deuce Man off at school this morning, you know, every morning we pray together, I pray over him and things like that. And then this morning he, he wanted to know more about the bully and prevention day. Um, Cause like I was saying earlier, everyone at his school today, they're wearing orange in support of like national bully and prevention day or prevention month rather. But um, anyway, so I'm talking to him about, you know, what, what does it mean to be a bully and what should we do when we encounter bullies and things like that. So at the end of the conversation, he goes, I'm going to be a bully today. <laughs> and I was like, no, deuce man, like, no, you're not going to be a bully today. You're going to stand up against bullies. But um, today is Monday, first day of the work week, and I'm anticipating like an easier day. It shouldn't be too much going on at work today. It's just getting back in the swing of things. But Deuce Man does have baseball practice today, and I haven't been to any of his practices in a while. So I was thinking about maybe going to see him practice this afternoon, but I'm still not sure yet. But we'll see. But yeah, this traffic is getting kind of was working today, okay? <laughs> but um, work work was pretty good. Work was working. I did get a chance to get off work early today, so I'm excited about that. Just leaving the gas station. I've been obsessing over these yuhus, so I've just been having to have them. But anyways, yes, I was able to get off work, so I get to go to Deuce Man's practice. I haven't been in his practice in some weeks now. I have to stop by the store because we need to find something to eat. When I walked out this morning, I was like, wow, like I could feel the fall here. So I was like, hmm, I'm gonna make me some chili. It's one of my favorite things to make. So I find every excuse to make chili. Like, oh, it's a little chilly outside, it's a little cool. Let me make some chili. <laughs> so I gotta go to the store to get some stuff for chili. And Deuce Man was saying that um, one of his friends in his class, one of his friends in his class has a Paw Patrol cup, like a Paw Patrol water cup, and he wants one. So I was like, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can find him a Paw Patrol cup. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna go right up here. It's this Publix and Walmart that's in the same plaza. So I'm gonna go to Publix to get some, to get the stuff for the chili, and then I'm gonna go to Walmart to see if I can find a cup. Like this Paw Patrol cup, and they also have one here. I like this one better. So let me see. Oh nope, this one has a straw. That is definitely out. Juice Man's been chewing on his straws okay this one's better all right i'm gonna get this one all right 
hopefully he likes it. I was able to get Deuce Man's cup. I'm so excited. <laughs> and I'm excited because I know he's going to be so excited. Like, I love being able to do little small things for my son. Like, I'm very blessed and very fortunate because a lot of parents are not able to buy, you know, their child or take anything like that for granted. And my baby, he's so grateful. He's so appreciative. He's so humble. Like, the smallest things makes his little heart smile. When me and my baby go to the Dollar Tree, we ball out, okay? And he's like the happiest person in the world. But um anyways what am i doing oh okay so i'm headed to my grandma's house i'm gonna meet my husband there deuce man's me me went to pick him up from school and then we're gonna head to his baseball practice in like another hour or so but in the meantime i do have some work to do oh, while i'm waiting on deuce man's practice to start like i'm gonna be you know getting my work done that way when we get home we can you know hang out and have some fun Deuce man, are you ready for practice? You're doing awesome. <laughs> Good job, baby. Came home. Boys, they haven't gotten here yet, but I'm just gonna show you guys how I make my super quick and easy chili. It is a three ingredients chili, so yeah, one, two, three, okay. So you need the meat, of course, because I'm not considering this an ingredient. You need the chili pack, the chili seasoning pack. You need tomato sauce and dark kidney beans, and then I like to pair my chili with rice and rice. Man, it's back from practice. What do you have? I cook. Yummy. You need a plate, baby. Okay. Okay, put the French put the French fry here. Good job. And clean and put the other French fries on there too. Good job, baby. Can mommy have a French fry? Yeah. Of course. Of course? Yeah. Okay. I got more French fries here. And you have ice cream. Where's your ice cream? In the car. Okay. And I got some toys. Oh, wow. Pokemon. And I can't eat it. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. Go get your iPad, baby. Okay, so the first thing that I do is brown my ground chuck. And I do prefer ground chuck over ground beef. And then while this is cooking, I'm going to get my rice started. So the secret to getting the perfect rice, you want to add equal numbers of rice and water. So if I'm doing two cups of rice, I'm going to add two cups of water to the rice a little bit of butter, and a little bit of seasoning. And voila. Perfect rice. I'm actually gonna make two and a half cups of rice. And I like to use jasmine rice. My favorite rice. Then I'm gonna turn the heat. Okay, so I'm gonna use some Lari seasoned salt, just a little bit because I'm gonna add the Lee seasoning pack. This is Badia Complete, one of my favorites. Powder and garlic powder. So I have my burner on low. I've drained my meat. Now I'm just going to add some tomato sauce. dark red kidney beans. I'm gonna add all the beans. I didn't put all the sauce in there. I like to add a little bit of sauce at first and then add more as needed. Give this a little stir. And I'm gonna add the seasonings. And I just get the McCormick um, chili seasoning pack. I love chili, like I find any reason to make chili. Walk outside, feel a little breeze. Ooh, time to make some chili. <laughs> and then that's it y'all that's really it i'm gonna let this cook for about 10 minutes make sure all the seasonings are good and incorporated and then yeah all right guys the rice should be done perfecto 
Perfecto. It's time for Deuce Man to take a bath. No, I want to take a water bath. I want the water. Okay. Whenever Deuce Man says he wants to take a water bath, that just means he wants to fill up the tub and put all his fishies and everything in there. So, is that what you want to do? Yeah. Okay guys, now I'm getting ready to plate the food. So everyone always asks how I get like a nice, aesthetically pleasing scoop of rice. So I'm gonna show you. Basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna get some type of circular cup. So I'm just gonna use the measuring cup. I'm gonna add the rice to the measuring cup and then just hold it on the plate. Okay, so I have the rice. Just put it on the plate really quick. And voila. Too easy. Okay guys, my rice did fall. Typically it doesn't, so I'm not sure why it fell this time. Probably because the chili was still super hot. But anyways, here is my dinner plate. I just fixed the big portion, I won't eat all of this. Right, see what this chili is hitting for. I you know it's gonna be good. Mm. So good, so quick and easy. But that is gonna be it for today's Vlogtober video. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night.